hey guys welcome to my channel today i wanted to show you how to become very powerful even before very first boss before big boss like uh, little johnny and you will get level 9 equipment which is end game stuff that you can use from the very beginning to to the last boss you can finish the game with that equipment so you you will become very very powerful and you can you will make the game super easy so first thing first i uh, got this guy here and i choose one that has no armor on his right hand so i can get his weapon so i will cut his limb in a moment and i will change to that hammer type uh, weapon and what i'm gonna use is fully charged r2 or vertical uh, vertical attack and that's already is big big change you, you will make the game so much easier just from that as you can see this is very difficult uh, opponent uh, very early in the game when you have no armor whatsoever and this weapon just makes the game so much easier but we will get way way stronger not just that way way stronger so we're gonna collect some very important implants and very important armor so this is one of the most important uh, implants it will always ta target the right limb so if you want to cut uh, a right hand or, or a leg whatever you, you cut in it's very useful especially on some bosses that otherwise is very difficult to get the right cut now I these guys here have one of the best armor in the game it's got very good set bonus uh, one gives more experience and the other one uh, get cuts without using any any energy which is very very useful I highly recommend to use this uh, armor set so now we're moving forward and now we we go through that uh, security gate these enemies already are very strong and you can upgrade your uh, equipment a little bit now we're going up we're not supposed to go here just yet so this enemy is level 5 and it's quite difficult the first time the first time you want to kill it but as soon as you get the weapon and uh, upgrade this a little bit, they become very easy as well. So here you go, very quickly if you upgrade the weapon. And if, it's, if you have that hammer, it's very good weapon. Uh, if you get that hammer, you can uh, farm those guys as well, these robot dogs. And I recommend to get the tail cut as well, so you get some implants. The implant itself is very strong, but also if you collect them, you can upgrade your own implants. Especially the the one that <laughs> that heals you. Another important implant here, which stock your battery charges. And now one of these two enemies, the one with the hammer, very important implant, if you cut his head. This one, this is the only enemy in the game, as far as I know, uh, having that implant. Uh, will get double the materials from the cuts so it will speed up our farming and that rhino guy uh, has got very good set I I highly recommend to get all the parts from that guy so now we're moving forward and we're gonna farm some uh, some XP to get some levels and become even stronger which we already quite strong. Level 5 is, is quite a lot at this point of the game. So moving here. And here is probably the best farming spot uh, in the first half of the game. It can be quite difficult. So if you want to make it easy, you can quickly go to that lift and uh, lure the, the guys to, to use that lift and uh, kill them one by one. To not jump down and don't fight all of them at once downstairs but you can if you want if you're good enough you can you can do that so this guy here if you've got dlc it's got very good armor but i'm not gonna use it just in case you know you don't have a dlc and this is one of the very important implant that doesn't look like a important one but it makes this this build and uh, this setup i'm using so much easier so every time you charge an attack, and I'm using only charged attacks, you have more um, 
more defense and more like poise so you don't your attacks won't get interrupted so after that i'm moving towards the the first boss but we will do very important stuff so now get any heavy armor upgraded i chose uh, i chose uh, rhino but it can be any heavy one so this is all my implants are focused on uh, energy building so i have more healing and now this will be very tricky jump so this part of the game you definitely definitely shouldn't be here just yet but if you jump just right you can get to that very difficult enemy here now i'm not gonna cut his right hand or left hand in that case just yet because he is very difficult so i will cut his leg first and to make him easier just stay very very close if you get further away his attacks can one shot you so if you this is level 9 enemy this big one but over here is level 8 enemy you can also farm be careful he's not that easy as well so you can cut all his limbs collect all his armor and uh, and weapon and this guy have two kind of weapons and two kind of armor so he's got a purple uh, limbs sometimes which is a uh, tougher one I that's give different parts so now I'm coming back and I will try to cut uh, the limb uh, with the weapon from this guy which is very difficult if you don't feel strong enough just uh, focus on the blue limb and farm the other guys first but if you good enough then you can you know you can kill him and cut his uh, weapon hand in this case his left hand no, i barely survived here and now i can upgrade weapon to level nine i farm a little, a little bit more and now this part becomes very easy So I'm using drone to speed it up and to make sure I will get the cut because at this point you do crazy damage and it's much easier to miss the cut because you do too much damage now I always backstab this guy follow with vertical attack which launch him make it very easy And when you upgrade everything, this is how powerful you get. You can one shot almost any enemy for the first half of the game. And the bosses are easy until the end. Any boss, every single boss is very easy. One shot, one shot, one shot. And now, just to show you how easy is Little John. Now, I try to be very bad so i don't do a single party and i don't block nothing i just charge the attack and aim for the part i want to destroy but you don't even need to do that you can trade blows just to the combos so i really try my my worst over here and i almost don't lose uh, don't lose uh, any health and also the energy you can see almost always fully charged this weapon generates tons of energy for healing so the game is stupidly easy now so it kind of, kind of breaks the game so it's up to you if you want to do that but if you already you know finish the game so many times and just want to experiment and see how you know end game equipment works early in the game so you can try that for fun maybe so yeah that's how it looks like very easy level 9 equipment at before the very first big boss so yeah thanks you for watching and see you around guys